Good morning, happy Wednesday everyone. We have come for a walk to Tarleton Battlefield. It's a circular walk that takes about two hours. We're not going to complete the whole walk however because part of it goes on to a 60 miles per hour road which I'm not all too comfortable with walking next to. But we're going to take the most of it. And Today's video is going to be a quick one, which I'll explain why in a couple of seconds for you guys, I suppose. Perhaps a couple of minutes for me. Grace is currently collecting sticks again. What is it with my toddler and sticks? Sticks, sticks, sticks! I'll show you. Get kitty! Okay, so who knew this YouTube channel would be history, photography and lifestyle? Essentially, what we're walking around is both the mass grave of the victims of the battle and also the battlefield itself. It happened on Palm Sunday, 1461. How many years is that? Eight hundred years ago? My goodness. It's bonkers, isn't it? What I really like about this walk is it's kind of hidden. You don't know it's there unless you accidentally stumble upon it, as we did parking in the wrong area. Oh well, what's life without a few mistakes? So I mentioned a couple of seconds ago that this video is not going to be a long one at all and there are a few reasons for that. Grace is currently having snack time. No! No, eat your biscuit and sit down! So yeah, my point of today's video I was finding, me myself, that as I started the YouTube channel, as I, whilst I'm in the process of building a business and a online presence, it was both having a positive influence upon my life, but also a negative influence in the fact that if I didn't have enough time on a particular day to get to go out and explore and record at a different location. Instead of doing what I would have done before starting YouTube and just going out and exploring for the allotted time that I do have, I was kind of just sitting in and saying, well, what's the point? I'm not going to be able to record it, so why? And that is why we've come to Towton the um, battlefield walk because it's it's one of those walks that it's beautiful and you take it in and you can appreciate the history and it just kind of has that peaceful atmosphere despite being out in the open and it's a nice, beautiful walk that you can go on and reflect. I wouldn't recommend bringing a pushchair because it makes it incredibly difficult. It's not quite that smooth. But on the flip side, there's not that many compositions. It's not a place that I want to go to and take loads of images at all. So my point is, and my message, is just go out. Just step foot out the door with a 
couple of snacks in your bag, enough water, and walk, explore, appreciate, appreciate what we have around us. And don't fall into the social media trap of, well, if I'm not sharing it with anyone, what does it matter? Because you matter and having those experiences and those memories is more important than your Instagram profile. So yeah, there's my mini rant over. Just appreciating the view that I have around. It's a very nice windy day, but nice and nice and cool. Yeah. I'm gonna switch it around now and show you the view that I'm currently looking at. It is beautiful. Okay, so as you can see, or perhaps you guys can see compositions that I'm not seeing. But to me personally, there isn't much in this view that I can kind of go, right, I wanna build a composition of that. But on the flip side, it is nice to come here and reflect and see the history. Especially read boards that they have. Hi, Gracie! Dotted around everywhere. Talking to you about the armour, the burial graves. Just, it's a nice free day out or morning out. Definitely recommend it. Okay? So I'm going to finish having snack time with Gracie and then we are going to walk back to the car. Okay, so we have just got back to the car and all the horses are out. Aren't they beautiful? Such nice, calm creatures with a hidden temperament. But yeah, sorry my, sorry my video isn't so third time lucky sorry today's video isn't like my usual content but I want to also show the human side of me and that means being honest because it's also by doing that that I actually inspire more creativity in myself and my own practice I really need some new glasses I'm constantly doing this but yeah remember if you like this video give us a thumbs up subscribe and hit the like button. Have an amazing Wednesday. Bye bye.